Well, in my never-ending struggle to combat pests in the garden, I've got a new foe to deal with. It's called the leaf miner. Here's a look at what it does. You see that leaf right there with the little racetrack thing going around inside of it? Those are leaf miners. Now what happens is mama leaf miner comes along and lands on your, your plant and then she gives you a little present. <laughs> she injects the larva into the center of the leaf. And what happens then is it, uh, uh, as it matures, it begins to eat its way out through your leaf. And she'll do that throughout. Typically, these things will uh, last about two generations in the spring. They like young, tender plants. And then they're done for the season. One of the things that you can do is pull the leaf press it real hard to kill the thing and then get it off your property. I wouldn't throw it in a compost pile because if you don't kill it, you could have more of what you don't want in your compost and then it's going throughout your garden. The other thing you can do is do what I did. And I picked up some, uh, it's called Safer Brand Indol Insect Killer. It kills 45 different insects. Gets the eggs, the larva, takes care of adults. The nice thing about this is it'll also take out white flies, aphids, uh, all kinds of nasties. It'll take out asparagus beetles, bean beetles, uh, blister beetles, Colorado potato beetles, all kinds of beetles, caterpillars, the cabbage loopers, you know, it's got a little bit of BT in it, it's got a little bit of neem, um, cabbage loopers, army worms, horn worms, leaf hoppers, um, all kinds of nasties and the aphids and the white flies. So, it's called Indol Insect Killer. It's organic, it's OMRI certified, and uh, it's good for same day harvest. The only thing is they don't want you to apply it any more than 10 times during the season. But all I'm gonna do now is give it a good spray. Top and bottom, and she's done. You can see right there one of the holes that it left behind. And sometimes you'll see the little white squiggly racetracks and some black marks inside. That's their droppings, what they leave behind on the plant. Saturating the leaves, though, is uh, going to kill them dead and stop the spread. Well, guys, that's it. That's how I'm going to deal with the leaf miners. If I have enough leaves, I'll remove the leaf and get it off a of property. If I don't, I'm going to spray it, soak the leaves, that way when they munch on them, <coughs> dead bugs. Guys, this is Reagan 971. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you found this helpful. If you got any other ideas on how to combat leaf miners, I'm all ears. We'll see you next time.